Today is Wednesday, which means it's what's on the menu Wednesday. And we're going to be making a healthy enchilada sauce, which is low in sodium, low in sugar, and low in carbs. This is Regina from Healthy Happy Hooray, and let's get started. For our ingredients, you're going to need some garlic, one half of white onion, some sweet chipotle powder, some cumin powder, some monk fruit, about a teaspoon, a little bit of instant coffee, a pinch of cinnamon, a pinch of cloves, some tomato paste, and then finally we're going to need our dried chipotle peppers, some vegetable stock, and finally salt and pepper. Okay, so now we're gonna blend all the things together. We're gonna start with our garlic cloves. Here, put these in the blender. I wanna give these the first mix to get them really nice and incorporated. <laughs> okay. Oh God, there's stuff coming everywhere. <laughs> So now we're just basically taking what we had from the blender and mixing it with the tomato paste. This is the final step. We're just gonna check it for salt and pepper and sweetness. I did need a little bit of monk fruit in here, a little bit more. It was a little bit sour, so I put some monk fruit, about a teaspoon, and I also added one teaspoon of salt and pepper. And that's it, it's finished, and it was super good. I was amazed at the consistency you didn't need to put any flour in this at all. It's really good. So you can store the enchilada sauce in the refrigerator up to three days in a Tupperware container. I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe and next week we'll be making keto tortillas. Hope to see you then. Have a great day.